Flowers the leading scorer this season for the Cougars at 13 points per game. A volume shooter, averages 11 field goal attempts a game. An alley-oop as they find Langston Wilson again. He's already doubled up his season average, A.B. That was a rare three-pointer. Yeah, yeah, that goes back to your... You played before the three-point line, right, A.B.? <laughs> Don't you start with me, young man. <laughs> Muhammad Gay has all six of Washington State's points so far. I mean, they're coming in and growling and just eating the rim. A lot Whoa. of paint points here early. This time, F.A. Abogidi, the sophomore from Nigeria with the slam. Eat your heart out, lefty Duncan, and then... Abagini. Maybe run the table there if they get an opportunity. These two teams meeting on back-to-back -back games tonight and Saturday as Muhammad Gay, a mid-range and one. He is up to 10 points now. Coming down, that's a makeable shot for him, and I like Terrell Brown, that force in his offense. That's another shot. After the miss, it's F.A. Abogini. One for nine now after that Flowers miss. You see the rebound stats there. Just one rebound separating the margin. Flowers trying again on the far side. And the second three-pointer of the game for Flowers and for the Cougars as a team. Zone at times in the first half, so they've been mixing up their looks against the Huskies. Ball knocked away from Terrell Brown. As the leading scorer in the Pac-12, Brown has had few and far opportunities on the offensive end. And for Washington, you see seeing now Brown, Terrell Brown off the ball. They've got some size on a Noah, but he, that's what he's got to do. Attack the oh, basket. Oh, Giddy sends him. So for the Huskies, they got to have a bend, but don't break. Seven of the nine rebounds that Albert Giddy has pulled down have been on the offensive glass. It's P.J. Fuller. Eight turnovers now on Washington State. Washington has closed the gap down to seven. Brown step back at the free throw line. The Huskies need some more of that as Brown is up to six points. I just, I just love the different wrinkles that each team seems to have, especially down the stretch as they've figured out their rotations, figured out who they're going with and who their game time players are going to be. And then you've had 17 by Fuller. Both of those guys on their teams have been fantastic. Count it for Terrell Brown as he was sprawled across the floor. Knowing who he is, that's where he's effective. He was shooting three-pointers. Abogidi oh. trying to dunk that one from the free-throw wow. line. Came up way short. Back the other way, P.J. Fuller brings Washington within one. Remember at the 445 mark, I said, can Washington State finish? Now they've got to execute. Abogidi, his 10th offensive rebound of the game. It will be a victory at home on the Palouse for Washington State. Against their in-state rival, well done. They earned that one. Enjoy it because in 48 hours, you've got to strap it up and do it again against the same team.